Welcome to Sara's class. Today we are discussing the problems related to electric power and Joule's law of heating. So we can go to the topic. So the first problem. An electric bulb is connected to a 220 volt generator. The current is 0 0.50 ampere. What is the power of the bulb? So in the question what is given? The voltage is given as 220 volt. The voltage is given as 220 volt and current is given as 0 0.50 ampere. The current is given as 0 0.50 ampere. So we have to find the power. We know that the equation to find the power P is equal to P into I. So V is given, I is also given. So we can directly substitute the values. So here what is the value of P? 220 and it is I is 0 0.50. So the answer is 110 watt. So the answer is 110 watt. The unit of power is watt. So the power is 110 watt. So we can go to the next problem. So second question. An electric motor take 5 ampere from a 220 volt line. Determine power of the motor and the energy consumed in 2 hours. So we, what is given the question? The current is given as a 5 ampere. The current is given as 5 ampere and the voltage is given as 220 volt. Voltage is given as 220 volt and the text time is given as 2 hours. So we have to convert that into second. So we have to multiply with the 60 into 60. So what's the answer? 2400 second 6. 6 6 are 12, 12 twos are 24. So time is 2400 seconds. Next we have to find the energy. So here what is the equation to find the energy? E is equal to P into T. The time is given. The power is not given in the question. So we have to first we have to find the power. The current is given and the voltage is given. So first we have to find the power. So what is the equation to find the power? P is equal to V I. So we can substitute the values for V and I. So V is 220 and current is a 5. So here answer is a 1100 watt. The answer the power is 1100 watt. So here next we have to find the energy. So here we are substituting the values 1100 what is the time 2400. 2400. So we are getting the answer as 7, 9, 2, 4 zeros are there. 4 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4. So here we can put the decimal place and take the power. So 1, we are taking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 places. So here 7.92 to the power 10 raised into 10 raised to 6. So what is the unit of, unit of energy? It is Joule. So the unit of energy is Joule. So third question, a potential difference of 250 volt is applied across a resistance of 500 ohm in an electric iron. Calculate the current heat produced for 10 seconds. And so what is given the question? So here the voltage is given as 250 volt. The voltage is given as 250 volt and the resistance is given as 500 ohm. The resistance is given as 500 ohm and the time is given as 10 seconds. So first we can calculate the current. So what's we know the relation V is equal to I into R. V is equal to I R. So we have to find the current. So what's the equation to find the current? I is equal to V divided by R. So I is equal to V divided by R. So what is V? It is 250 and the resistance is 500. So we are cancelling. So we are getting as a 5 divided by 10. So the answer is 0.5 ampere. So the answer is 0.5 ampere. So the current produced in that conductor is 0.5 ampere. Next we have to find the heat produced. So here heat produced. What is the equation to find the heat produced? H is equal to I square R T. H is equal to I square R T. So what is I? It is 0.5 whole square into what is resistance? 500 and what is the time? It is 10 seconds. So here what is the answer? So the answer is 1250 joules. So the answer is 1250 joules. So the heat produced in the electric can is equal to 1250 joules. So we can go to the next question. 
So the fourth question, calculate the heat produced when 96,000 coulomb of charge is transferred in 1 hour through a potential difference of 50 volt. So we can write the answer. So here the charge is given as the charge, what is the equation, what is the letter to denote the charge Q. So the charge is given as 96,000 coulomb, 96,000 coulomb and time is given as 1 hour. So we have to convert that into seconds. So 60 into 60 seconds. So it is a 3600 3, seconds and the potential difference is given as a 50 volt. The potential difference is given as a 50 volt. So first we have to find the, the, Q, the charge is given and the time is given. So first we have to find the current. So we know that the current I is equal to Q divided by T. I is equal to Q divided by T. So we can substitute 96,000 divided by 3,600. So two zeros cancel. So next is 960 divided by 36. So the answer is 26.67 ampere. So the answer is 26.67 ampere. Next we have to find the resistance. Then only we can find out the heat produced. So resistance is not given. So first we have to find the resistance. So V is equal to, we know the relation V is equal to IR. So from that R is equal to V divided by I. So R is equal to V divided by I. The voltage is given and the current is given. So here voltage is 50 volt and the current is 26.67. So we are getting the so we are getting the answer as 1.8 ohm. We are getting the resistance as 1.8 ohm. We are getting the resistance as 1.8 ohm. Next we have to find the heat produced. Heat produced is equal to I square R. T. H is equal to I square RT. So here what is I is 26.67 whole square into what is the resistance? Resistance is 1.8 and what is the time? 3600 second. 3600. So the answer is when substituting all these values we are getting the answer as 4788.4 joules. 4788.4 joules. So heat produced is 4788.4 joules. So thank you for watching the class. We can meet in the next class. So thank you for watching.